Hello, beautiful souls. Happy Monday. Um, let's talk about this because I'm a little kind of like disturbed. Even though this is something that probably like eight or nine months ago I talked about briefly here in one of my videos. Um, going back a little bit, you know, last year I dated this girl for a few months. I have a situation shape. Her name was Chris. And, you know, it got really intense real quick and everything and whatever. But we even call a situation ship because we were, we knew there was no moving forward. And we were like, just let's have fun until one of us is not longer single. Um, and, you know, whatever. We got this type of connection. And after that, I, I met my soul sister that was related. It was like a some kind of connection that let all the dominance lay down in order and together but anyway so one time we were talking and she told me about how i am a person that even though i cater to people i made them feel like i'm gonna be okay and perfect without them like i make them just feel and think that i don't need nobody and i told her Yes, because I really don't need nobody. I want to be with somebody, but I don't need it. So, I was talking with this other person that we briefly dated. Nothing ever happened. Um, and in different words, she told me the same. And, you know, the now with the situation that I'm going through, it was really, really, really brief. But this person is like, oh, you're better off. You're better without me or whatever. Like, and, and this is the thing. And when you get awakened, that's one of the things that's going to happen. That people's going to start changing or whatever. Like, I never have this much confidence in my life. I have never felt more secure, more beautiful, more qualified, more prepared for everything. For that reason being, I'm a Libra. I'm a hopeless romantic. I want to be with somebody. I want a relationship. I want certain things, but at the same time, I know myself. I know my value. And I know that my happiness doesn't depend on nobody. And it's so bad putting that out there. Like, I'm not putting, like, I'm not constantly telling the person I don't need you. Because, like, I am one of the most fucking catered person that you can know. I'm a fucking Virgo moon. That's what I do. That's how I show love. Like, I will buy you things. I want to make you a massage. I want to cook for you. I want to clean. I want to do your errands. I want to just call you, tell you you're beautiful, you, you need it. I'm trying to, to lift to up or whatever. But we become like, yes, I want to, but I don't need nobody. And I want to be happy regardless we are with me or not. Yes. That I going to miss you like I do right now? Yes. But like, I, and I don't know if it's... I know that if you're not going through this journey, you're not going to understand how can you love yourself so much and love somebody else as well. And that's the real love. I'd say that in my whole video, in my last video. And it's not about not loving. It's about respecting yourself. And sometimes even though we know that we let things just be and roll because we really care about the person. And I'm really emotional and sentimental. And I'm a really loving, caring person for whoever. And I, I, I'm a Libra. And I, even though if we are not the besties, if it's something I feel is not right, that is unfair, I'm going to stick on my head for anybody because that's the fucking person I am. And some people might think, ah, oh, you're talking bullshit. People know me. I know me. But when I say in song, it's fucking done. So it's just, it's kind of wild to me that you can do all of this. And just because you love yourself, people think that you don't want to be with nobody. We are humans, and regardless people want to say whatever they want, we are not meant to live a life alone. And the same that I think that we are not born to be monogamous all the life. That's, with, that's a lot of cheating. And that's the, one, that's the reason I put it out there. I don't hide it no more. And it's fucking hard to find somebody. They agree with you, because it's not even about sex. I have said this a thousand times, but I... We are not, like, I don't believe on that. I can love you so much, and you're still going to be attracted to others. I feel like I'm jumping here at the tip because I had talked about this before. I'm just a little concerned. Not concerned, I'm a little aggravated, to be honest. I'm a little kind of like, like, what the 
the fuck? So, this is like, I just need to be begging somebody, crying. I tell them that I can't live without them. So they can feel like they are worthy of my life, of my time, of my space. So here we go, one more time. Because my phone got overheated, like what happened when I'm driving. Because Florida is freaking hot. So let's continue talking about the topic. So, just because... Like in life, they wanna let us and teach us and tell us that you always have to be caring more about what you need and not what you want. And in certain aspect, it's true when it becomes about how you uh, spend your money, how you're gonna live your life. But I don't feel, I don't think, and I really don't believe is the case when it becomes to fucking love. And if I'm wrong, somebody enlighten me, please. Enlighten me and let me know that I'm fucking wrong because I'm open to that and learn and change my mentality if I'm fucking wrong, if somebody can prove me enough that I'm wrong. So just because I don't need somebody, that doesn't mean that I will walk away. That doesn't mean that you're not gonna be relevant, important in my life. That just means that I will want you out of love, no out of possession, no in the sense of of oh my god I need you to coexist. And like I don't know, like somebody please talk to me and let me put this here because I just go to work but it's a little early I at a place I don't know because I slept all fucking day um, I've been oversleeping since you know I'm going through all this bullshit right now um anyway um so when it comes to that you just should be happy that somebody wants you that doesn't mean that I'm not gonna try to work things out because I'm a person that I will go into the last straw like I just don't walk away from people and I don't know. I don't know. I, I just feel that it's not nothing wrong with with me being just vocal and 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 just express that here and there that you know I let you know like I want you but I don't need you to coexist. Especially when I'm not trying to nobody pay my bills, do nothing, I'm an independent woman, you know, so please let me know. And that's it because my camera is going to, oh, again, my phone is full. So.